Hi guys, welcome, welcome, welcome. Trying to get it so the glare. All right, so I just finished the past life one. Um, lots, 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 okay. Um, I will tell you what I liked about it is that every card, not every card, but what we were talking about earlier, the Page of Cups came out, you know, the Six of Cups, this is that, that fresh feeling with your soulmate, somebody from the past. There was I had three different, four, five, we touched base on three the most, but I think what's more shocking is that here's the deal. It's the overall energy, the chariot, all that. Everything came out again, okay? But I broke it down in different ways. So that's what I love about what it is again, what I do, because spirit always, 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 always confirms. Here's the deal, and I think this was the hardest one for a majority of you, is that you love this person so, so, so deeply. And um, it's so overwhelming. But here's the deal. You've had so many lives with this person. Some just a few and others way more. But, that's a big but, because as in love as you are with this person, okay, um, you really don't know them. And to me, that was the most shocking revolution that I saw. It's, it's a 35-minute video, 36 almost, and... I will tell you, again, he carried the six and the six, and you carried the seven and a seven. Again, it came out like that. And the six of six, the six and the six is all about unconditional love and, and, and moving forward. And the sevens were kind of, um, the lion I have on my phone. Beast mode. Um, but the sevens, let me do the sixes real super quick for you. Just going to tell you what the quote is. Um, it's during the darkest moments that we must focus on the light. And it's like the angel of the 66 is unconditional love and, and trusting in the higher powers helping. And it's just, it's having the faith in a huge life change. Okay. And then that was the masculine with the 66. And when with the feminine, it was the 77. It means you're more open, obviously more empathetic to people in your life, but you should really be blessed and proud of what's happening and what's about to happen in your life. And it also talks about your your life, your, you know, your path, all that stuff, um, and using your intuition. And it's a deep connection you feel for somebody, and it has to do with natural and the spiritual worlds, okay? So it's like, it's just what you guys are carrying right now for energy, and I, and I think it's beautiful because this person truly does love you. And it's like the feminine, there's, there's so much doubt, but it's linked. Okay, don't worry about it. The masculine has doubt too, but you're going to be okay. But I think the, the biggest revelation was you literally, you're so in love with somebody. And it's deep and it's profound and it's heart-wrenching. And I think the hardest thing for you, because it's like you're saying to yourself, like, holy shit, will I even like this person? And that was like a big wake up call for me because we've been reading this story for almost a year. And it's like, we talked about love and the passion and we it talked about all that stuff. But now it's like, and you guys, trust me, you're going to, you're going to like this person. You guys are going to fall in love and you will. Okay. But it's, it's like, whoa. Because have you really thought to yourself out of all this love and the deep feeling that you've had throughout the years even, you know, it's like, do I like this person? Do I know this person? But love trumps like, <laughs> you know what I mean? So it's like, don't really worry about it. But it's like, it's not really something that's been presented to us like that. Okay. So it's like, whoa. So the video is ready, guys. And... um you can purchase this for, um, what do we want to do it for? Let me just, let me Google. I know you're like, oh, cool. But I want to say, this is what I want. And I'm trying to figure out why. Okay, yeah. So 1010. Okay, and it's, it's because you can trust with, you can trust me with all your heart because I promise I will never break it. So that's the divine talking to you too. But more or less it's, it's gateways and we've been seeing the 1010. But it talks about a strong point of spiritual growth and an awakening. And that's how it came out. But 
it's it, it calls for you to stay optimistic and focus on what needs to be focused on. It's encouragement from the divine power. Okay, so and there's you got to trust this. Okay, so ten ten. Um, I was I was really surprised. I'm more like, oh, who you like? Who you like this person? It's a, it's, it's a, that's us. It's huge, guys. Don't, it's because you're like, wow, quote, I never really thought about it like this. Because it's like, you love, right? You love people. But it's like, have you ever been in the energy where you're like, oh, fuck. I, I love you, but like, I don't like you. You know what I mean? Like, and I got the goosebumps. So you all know what I'm talking about. But I guess you never really looked at it in this perspective with this person. Because it's, it's just been this deep, profound feeling. All right? But it's like... Trust me, you will you will like this person. But right now, I don't know if it came up because you're gonna question it. It also came up because I feel like this person knows you better than you know them. Or here's the deal, you know each other just as well. But someone has the advantage of really knowing somebody more than the other person in the physical world, spiritually, telepathically, not so much. Your souls, your souls know each other. But some people. What I'm trying to say is some people, like say you're a reader, for instance, and this person's been watching you, you feel like they got the upper hand. Trust me, they don't They don't have the upper hand. You're super spiritual. You know these things too, okay? So don't worry about that aspect. See what I'm saying? It's like certain worries came up and it's like that's the, the least of, of your freaking worries, okay? For real. <laughs> so... 1010. I love you. I'll be back later, Gators. Bye. I love you.